Next question comes from Stevo on YouTube. Hey, Adam. I am having issues with my glycol system, and I had to transfer a finished beer to my single-walled serving tank in the walk-in uh, while the beer was at 68 degrees F. Or is that 20 degrees C? Can I carbonate this beer at 48 F? The answer, no. Uh, or probably not within the recommended safety specs for that tank. You're going to have a really hard time doing it uh, in that single-walled tank. My guess is your tank is only rated to about one bar or 15 PSI. And at 48 degrees, it ain't going to happen. So, uh, yeah, this is a this is a bad situation um, because if you are if if this is a, if you listen to it as a clip or if you are listening just a few minutes ago, you know, we talked about in order to get a beer clear, uh, appropriately fined and or filtered, you need to be able to get that very cold. Think zero degrees centigrade or 32 degrees Fahrenheit, maybe even a little colder. And when you do that, you're going to be. Uh, creating as much haze as you can, and then you're going to be stripping that out, either with your fining agent, with your filter, what have you, okay? So he's going to have this issue. So in a perfect world, what I would recommend is you would be using the cooler as your uh, crashing uh, scenario. Um, so he would uh, transfer that beer in the tank that doesn't have any HVAC um, because his glycol system has failed. Push that beer into your uh, serving tank and our bright tank, whatever that's in the cooler. Uh, wait for that tank to get down to temperature. If you can get that walk in even a little bit colder, maybe 35, 34, um, get, uh, get that beer as cold as you can. And then I would push that beer into another vessel. I would transfer it again um, with at, either after finding it once it's at the colder temperature and then transferring or filtering into another vessel. But filtering it at that warm temperature won't do you anything uh, because you're going to have uh, chill haze leaking out your rear end and uh, it, it just not going to get the job done. So that's my recommendation uh, for, for all that stuff. Uh, I, I appreciate the question, Steve-O. So he's actually a guy that I've, I, I've known for a minute. So we were just talking shop the other day and that was, that was from that conversation. Okay.